here. Normally you see me out on the range demonstrating some exercises or you'll see me in our golf gym studio doing them, but today I'm doing something in our home. And I'm coming to you with our brand newest, our brandest newest product, and it's called the Power Hip Trainer. Now, most of us struggle, most golfers, I would say a huge percentage of golfers, struggle with figuring out what does it mean to rotate my hips. We hear uh, the commentators talking about, oh my, Rory, Rory McIlroy has, you know, his hips turn at 150 miles an hour mm -hmm. and in relation to his swing. And, and so, but, but we don't ever feel what it's like, the feeling of rotating our hips in a swing. And rotating our hips is so important because it helps us to get all the way through the, our swing and through impact and into a nice follow through. So I've got this product, our, again, a brand new product called the Power Hip Trainer. And it's very simple. What you do on this one, if you're a right-handed player, and you can use it on either side, but we'll demonstrate, right now we're gonna demonstrate for a right-handed player. And I've got it affixed. It comes with a loop attachment and a door attachment. So I've got it placed in our door here, nice and secure on the hinge side, so that's not coming out. But the way we're gonna do this is I want you to take your lead hand. So if you're left-handed, it'll be your right hand. If you're um, right-hander, it's gonna be this hand, my, my left hand. And you turn around, swivel, and grab the, Grab that handle, put it at the middle of your back, and rotate around so that the cord is right across your belly, basically. <clears throat> now I want you to get in a nice position, a nice golf position, nice flat back, and get with enough resistance so you can feel the turn. Now, the way that we perform this exercise is you get in this position right here and really feel it, and you can feel that your hips actually want to turn on their own because of the resistance. So I want you to lower your, lower your, if you're a right-handed player, lower your right hand, your elbows nice and tight to your back, and you take your hand back as though you're doing a swing, kind of load up on the inside of that right leg, take it back here, now you're gonna feel more tension because we're coiling up and loading. And as you come down and through, you allow those hips, your shoulders start, but allow those hips to rotate around into impact, so our, our hips are fit now starting to face the target, they're not facing straight ahead like, most people do. So turn this way, get your hips there, here's impact, and I want you to finish with a nice big follow through. Up on that toe and hold. I want a little bit more tension, I want a little bit more resistance on this. So I'm gonna take it back, load up to that right side, get this shoulder down. We're not rotating up here, we're rotating in a nice golf posture, and then as you load, you're pressing down with this right side, coming through, I'm releasing my hips at impact here, and rotating on through. Now, another key thing here is, into impact, what you don't want to do is stand up from here, because that's standing up and out of your swing, out of your uh, golf swing. So just take it back here, keep that right shoulder down, so you got a nice flat back, great rotation, great posture, and as you finish through, finish down and through, as, just like you're swiping a stripe along the ground down this way, down and through, and into a great follow through. I'll tell you, if you do this regularly, you're gonna get, you're gonna get the resistance of the cord, which is gonna work on, those, on the muscles that you need, but also, you're gonna develop flexibility, because you're doing it nice and slow in an eccentric motion here. You're actually going against it. So try this exercise, check out golfgym.com for our new power hip Trainer, Power Hip Trainer, GolfTim.com, check it out, and I'll have more from the studio on how you can use this product a lot, lot more. We'll see you on the next video.